Hi guys, welcome back to Life of Jackie. Today we have a pretty fun video, at least it'll be fun for me, because I'm going to show you all of the things that I had on my registry. If you guys hear my kids in the back, which I'm kind of sure you will, I'm sorry, they're playing downstairs with brother and dad and they might be a little bit loud sorry just throwing that out there um another thing i want to mention before we get started is that these things are what i have found necessary the things i have found to be useful to me so this is just you know my opinion i'm not telling you to go out and buy these things i'm just sharing what i have bought for my baby, how I'm preparing for his arrival, and yeah, everything will be linked down below for you to check out if you know you want to. So another thing I wanted to mention was oh yeah, so I'm gonna mention it um, probably throughout the video, but all babies are different. So just because your first baby liked to have a pacifier does not mean that your second baby will like to have a pacifier. Just keep that in mind. The reason I'm mentioning this is because I don't want anybody to go crazy buying a certain brand of a bottle or too many pacifiers, too many swaddles, and so on. You want to make sure you kind of have just what's needed. If you notice your baby likes a certain bottle or, you know, whatever that item is then okay repurchase or purchase more and so on um, another thing i want to mention are registry boxes i will also show you the few things i got from the registry boxes that i signed up for i signed up for two i signed up with amazon registry and i had the baby list i think that's what it's called yeah baby list so that's why you really like the amazon one i think that one was the better one but yeah just you know sign up for registries make them a lot of them have different you know, incentives that they will give you for making a registry with them so for example the amazon also gave me a 15 percent discount from the things that were not purchased from my registry um, and I also, if I spent more than five or $500 on the registry, they give you, I think it's called a diaper fund. But basically, it's a discount for the first year on diapers, which is pretty good. Who doesn't want a discount on diapers, you know? Well, I have a lot to show you, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and start with the car seat because that is obviously a given. You need a car seat to leave the hospital with your baby. So here we have the stroller folded up. This is how you'd place it in the car. But um, it's very lightweight, very easily carried. And there we have the car seat on the stroller. So this car seat is very nice, very smooth. I love that it has a big space here at the bottom. This handlebar here is adjustable. Um, yeah, and it's just very easy to detach and attach back up. Very easy to fold up with one hand. And here it also came with the base for the car. So here now we have this separate attachment that comes with the stroller as well. And that is like this bassinet. Um, it has this umbrella here that goes on there or also if you pull this thing back here it turns into the um, like a seat for when the baby outgrows their car seat so it's very nice very comfy this goes on here so your toddler doesn't you know slip out or anything so yeah um, and again, it's this Maxi Cozy, the Zellia model. So this is one of the items that I have always found the most useful. 
my kids have loved this thing and that is a bouncer and it's by this brand right here ingenuity it's pretty cute it's got these little things here very soft nicely cushioned for when your baby's small this one is actually battery operated which means that it bounces on its own you turn it on it'll bounce it's got music sounds it has vibrations so very nice let's move on to the next item so another one of the big items that you are obviously gonna need very necessary a crib this crib is currently in my room being used by my two-year-old I am currently waiting on their beds I ordered a new bed for them that I will set up in their room so that they can sleep in there because they've been sleeping in our room for some time now um, but yeah so this crib I've actually had for a whole like three and a half years now since my second baby was born my first daughter and it's been great um, I put it to good use <laughs> um, and so the baby will be sleeping in here I got uh, new bed sheets for him and everything so I will set that up another big item that we have here is this changing table slash dresser it's currently in my daughter's room but like I said I'm setting up their room very soon so this dresser is gonna go to my room and you know their room is gonna look completely different it's this changing table here slash dresser is nice because once the baby is too big too old for the changing table this part comes off and then I will be left with just the dresser and then the changing pad here I got from Amazon as well believe it or not there is a bassinet in here and I actually love this it stores in this bag um, it's especially I think for traveling which is great because we like to travel or I like to visit family for a barbecue whatever it's great let me show you what's inside let me try to show you how easy it is to put together it also rocks you can set it to rock or to if you want it to stay still and not rock you have that option as well another thing I love is this here very easy to also put in there as you can see and now if you are outside Maybe having a barbecue at your family's house, whatever, etc. Your baby is in there, nice and comfy. He's got some shade. And then it has this mesh cover up. Maybe for bugs or whatever. So yeah, it's very nice, small, you know, travel friendly. And yeah by the brand Safety First and I got this at Target. Again, everything will be linked down so, below. Up next, I've got bath time. I like it because it's kind of small, but it's very lightweight. It's very comfy. It's got the headrest here. Um, in here, let me show you. Here, this is adjustable for the baby as the baby grows. And this tub is good for zero to 18 months. So until the, ba the baby is a year and a half. Okay, now I am moving on with feeding. So let's start off with this big old baby here. It's 
here is that right there this is the drying rack for your bottles um this is the first time i get one like this but it, i think it's actually great that it stands it's not going to take up so much space next to my sink you know it's got the space up here for passies down here for the bottle nipples um good amount of space for you know quite a few bottles from the brand oxo tot and bottles obviously the only ones that i purchased are these two here got this one here boon nourish i believe is the brand or just boon obviously you're gonna want them to be you know bpa free pvc important um and this is stage one also something you want to watch out for when you're purchasing bottles you want to watch out that they are for newborns so that they do not overflow for the baby the other brand i am trying is this Camo tomo which i read great reviews on um also bpa free there we go and it's a two pack purchased these two from Amazon as well I believe but like I said I only purchased these two because I don't know if my baby's gonna like these so you know you don't want to over purchase on bottles and then these two are ones this one I believe I got in my Amazon registry from the brand Nuke and actually I use these on my girls so I like them. Hopefully he does too. And then this one I got from my other registry, the Babyless one, brand Evanflow. So you know, I've got a few for him to try and hopefully he will love them all and I don't have to buy any more bottles. Um, another thing I find useful if you are going to formula feed your baby, I carry this in my diaper bag and you put just the right amount to make bottles makes your life a lot easier and you don't have to carry your can around um and then this here is a cover-up so if you will be breastfeeding this goes around your neck and you can easily cover yourself up for breastfeeding or it also works in different ways it works for um covering the car seat as well so if you want to keep your baby nice and safe for, I don't know, windy days, or you just don't want anybody to be looking at your baby, this is great. If you will be breastfeeding, these are two things here that I have used. I've used this for my last two kids. This is a manual breast pump. Um, it has worked great for me. This brand is pretty good. I like it. I haven't been big on breastfeeding but with this baby my goal is to mostly if not fully only breastfeed but we'll see how that goes maybe that you know that'll be a future video on my breastfeeding journey on my fourth child um, and then this is something amazing this is a Hakka silicone breast pump so it's got a suction base so what this basically is is when you're feeding your baby on one of your breasts the other one always leaks so this is pretty nice because you put it on your other breast and it catches all the milk that way you're not wasting any milk i think this is amazing love it i 100 percent recommend so i'm gonna move on with blankets blankets are obviously very necessary babies are very cold when they are newborns so let me show you the ones that i got i only have these four which i feel like that is enough to start off with if i need any more i will purchase more but honestly to start off i think four is just fine this one very nice and soft from target this one is from amazon i'm getting ready to wash everything which is why i'm also filming this video um, so I can just go ahead and wash everything now baby is due soon guys 
Um, these two, let's see, are these both from Ross? Yeah, these two are from Ross and they are very, very affordable. Ross has been closed, but um, it's back open now, but I'm not gonna go in there. <laughs> um, but anyways, um, Ross is a great place to grab yourself some blankets. Very soft, very nice, very, very affordable. Um, the other thing I have here is the baby's sheets for the crib. The three-piece crib set from Amazon. There we go. Dinosaurs, you know, you gotta have these little dinosaurs ready here. Um, so yeah, very cute from Amazon. So now I'm moving on with swaddles, guys. Um, also something very important because you gotta you want to keep your baby nice and tight nice and warm so let me show you the swaddles that I am loving right now sorry they're a little bit of a mess but um like I said I'm getting ready to wash everything so first and foremost I've got myself these two here I actually have three let me see I'll start off with this one so this is from the brand Lulu and Company, which I love. Their quality is great. I found them on Instagram, and I also love how um, their packaging is so cute. So if you guys are interested in getting maybe like a baby shower gift or something like that, this is super cute. They come in sets. They also have like um, baby clothes, hats, and all that, and you can gift a whole set so and so this one here is by they're the same brand and I like that they're so they're really big they are also very nice material very soft um, not too thick got this one here by the brand copper pearl again very nice thin material but very long, you know, for swaddling your baby. Very nice, loving it, very soft. And then I bought these on Amazon. They're just like receiving blankets. There's quite a few in the pack here, as you can see. And this is the brand Simple Joys by Carter's. And, um, that seems, you know, like whatever but is pretty important are burp cloths so babies need to be burped after their feedings and you know every time well not every time but usually they will spit up a little bit so it's nice to have these they go on over your shoulder like this when you're patting the baby that way they do not spit up on you and I like these these are by the brand copper pearl again and they are nice and thick so you know it's not gonna go through to your clothes so that's nice I've got quite a few I've got these and then I also have these I also have this pack that I got from Amazon again I like them because they're nice and Moving on to a few other items. I've got the boppy pillow here So obviously this is nice for when you're breastfeeding the baby. It gives you very nice support and It's very useful to the baby it Says nine months here, but um very nice for tummy time for sitting the baby up and obviously for breastfeeding so I also have these two swaddles. I just purchased two because, you know, like I said, you never know if your baby will like to be swaddled. Um, I got it in a small slash, in a small slash medium for zero to three months. Um, and yeah, they basically have Velcro, so you can easily swaddle your baby. It's supposed to be a lot easier, you know, than just a regular one. But um, I'm excited to try this out. I got two. I got this one from Target and I got this one from the brand The Oli Swaddle, I believe is what it's called.
called. So now I'm gonna move on to basically like diapering the diaper bag and also what I have on my diaper table. I mean on my changing table. So let's start off with the diaper bag. This one, I kind of spoiled myself a little bit on it. It's from the brand Mina Bay from Los Angeles. I love it. First of all, I like that this is washable because honestly, diaper bags get really dirty. You know, sometimes you set them down or your babies get to them and you know, they get dirty. So this is nice and cleanable or wipeable, I should say. A lot of room on the inside. It came with a changing pad. It has a very good amount of pockets inside. So I like that. This I got, this is a changing pad and I got it on one of the registries. This I think is nice because let's say you're out somewhere, you don't wanna carry your full diaper bag. You just, you know, wanna have wipes and a diaper. This is nice for that. You can put just the necessities in here and the wipes in here and put it on your stroller and you are good to go. This is a diaper cream brush, a mini one for your diaper bag. I find this very necessary so that you don't have to get your hands dirty. This swaddle here I forgot to mention, but um, I also got this on the Amazon registry. So, pretty cool. And then, obviously the registries, they come with a lot of samples, which is what I have here. Diaper samples, laundry detergent, I got different kind of wipe samples, kind of diapers and I also wanted to mention these baskets so these baskets I find very handy obviously I'm not gonna have it filled with so many things but like I'll have this the diaper cream wipes and diapers for when changing time comes I can easily you know everything is easily found everything is organized I'm gonna have one here on the changing table and then I'm also gonna have one downstairs and I got these baskets for $10 at Target down so. here in this other basket I have this other brand here that I have fallen in love with again I don't know if my baby is going to like a pacifier out of my three children that I have now, only one of them loves the pacifiers. I found this brand, I think I, someone mentioned it from YouTube or maybe I saw it on Instagram, but it's super cute. Basically, it's from this brand called Ryan and Rose. You guys can find them on Instagram. This is called a cutie clip. So it's basically a clip for the baby's pacifiers. And then a couple other things I have in here is this nose Frida. This is just a little thing for baby's first footprint for giving the baby medicine. I got this Frida baby Medi Frida. So it's like a pacifier attached to a syringe for easy, easy, um, you know what I mean for to easily give your baby medicine. Um, uh, and then this these are nail filers and a nail clipper because babies tend to scratch themselves so you want to make sure that you have these on hand to keep your baby's nails short or at least you know file them down so that they're not too sharp in here like i said i have to wash these but i have a couple socks i didn't buy too many socks for the baby because most of the newborn clothes comes with like footsies already. So I only have like a pack of these socks. I have a few hats here. I have a 
few hats these not too many of and then i have also just a few of these hand mittens because again a lot of the newborn clothes comes with the you know cover up for the hands okay so now we're moving on to the clothes i'm not going to show you every single piece but just what i find to be essential for your newborn um keep in mind you don't want to buy too many um in the newborn size because babies will grow like this i'm gonna start off with that brand that i had previously mentioned lulu and co or lulu and company so i bought this set here for my son for his pictures at the hospital it came with the hat the little mittens and this knot gown so this is super cute these come in this very cute packaging and you can buy them as sets so this you got your luxe swaddle blanket this is a top and bottom set and then they have the little you know accessories or additional items like the mittens and the hat and they have them in such cute and various uh, colors and different patterns so very nice and cute love that and i got two of these knotted gowns to try them out got like four sets of these top and bottoms very nice soft material comes with the pants for example this is a newborn set here and it comes like i said previously it comes with the footsies so you don't have to worry about that and it comes with this foldable here so that baby's fingers are nice and tucked in there and you don't have to worry about them scratching themselves and these are just basic onesies I try to always go with the zipper ones. You know, make your life easier. Get them with a zipper, much easier. Um, obviously, just, you know, the basic white onesies. This is a brand that I actually got from Amazon. This was in my registry, Moon and Back. I really like it, very nice and soft, to good quality. Um, this one comes with the hand, the footsies, nice and cute, little brother, and this one is from Old Navy, a lot of these are from Target, so here I've got the rest of his clothes, you know, it's not a whole lot, and just basic things, you know, onesies, and little rompers, so that is it for today. That was a lot, guys. That was a lot. <laughs> um, I hope I didn't forget to mention anything. Again, these are things that I have used in the past, things that I have liked, my kids have liked, and I hope that they can be useful to you, the information. Like I said, I will link as much as I can down below so that you can do your own research, sure that you guys read reviews, if you guys have any questions for me, don't hesitate to ask down below in the comments or my social media is linked down below. You can follow me and DM me. Um, oh, and I'm also filming another video this, maybe tomorrow. Um, I had a few people ask me some questions about pregnancy, about symptoms, and just about how I feel. I'm feeling currently so I am gonna be filming that maybe tomorrow or in the next couple days so if you guys have any questions for me ask me because I am gonna put them in my next video so I hope you enjoyed this video I'm sorry that it was a mess and I was kind of all over the place and it was a lot of talking and stuff but um, it's pretty fun for me to see everything you know that I'm gonna be using in the next couple weeks. The next video I'll also probably give a little bit of an update. 
on how far along I am and all of that jazz so stay tuned for that if you liked this video if you found it useful please like subscribe to my channel you guys know what to do so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye